Hey everyone, this is Paul from Orthoid Val Pal. I want to talk to you a little bit about Achilles tendinopathy and um, how to manage uh, Achilles inflammation and irritation. This gentleman here uh, not only has a little tendinopathy, but um, some swelling around his Achilles. He has a small partial tear. Um, and you can see where there is a little bit of swelling right in this area. Now he has good integrity. He has a negative Thompson test. So when I have him on his stomach, he plantar flexes nicely. He offers resistance. So can you push into my hand, push down hard. Um, and that is good. He's having pain when he's walking and it caused a lot of irritation in this area. He's undergone a course of physical therapy, some soft tissue modalities, some flexibility. He's worn a walker boot. He even um, uses a heel lift in his shoe, but still continues to have this chronic discomfort in that area. Um, so what we're going to do now that will be different than what he's had before is that we are going to support the arch a little bit better with an orthotic so that the heel is not rocking side to side. The Achilles likes to go straight up and down, but does not like to bowstring back and forth. The other thing we're going to do is we're going to start to put a little bit of a load on this. So an isometric plantar flexion in about this position, he's going to be holding on that. We're going to use a, a shuttle or even uh, some TheraBand to start with. And he's going to be holding that isometric position for 45 seconds and then take a 45 second rest. And he's going to do that five times. And as long as he is not painful, we're going to start to increase the load so that um, we put a little more pressure on that. Um, and and that can be pain relieving and it can also help build some integrity to that Achilles. Um, the other thing we are going to do is a course of uh, radial pressure wave therapy. So we're going to do that right on that spot right in this area and uh, we've had very good success especially with chronic tendinopathy um, type uh, issues with radial pressure wave. The last thing we're going to add to his program is going to be getting him into a rocker bottom shoe that is nice and solid. So we're going to use something like a Hoka and um, with a temporary orthotic in there to help support the arch and try to keep that Achilles rolling a little bit easier. By using the Hoka, we're not going to get such an aggressive dorsiflexion moment when he is walking. So that can help take that little micro trauma off that Achilles back there. Um, so we're going to put him through this program for about four weeks slowly increase the amount of load that we put on his Achilles and um, see how he does. And uh, if he, uh, if he uh, succeeds with that, great. If not, then we're going to talk to his podiatrist and uh, go to the next step. So I hope you liked today's video. If you did, give us a thumbs up and uh, please subscribe. Thanks.